Hello everybody. Now the previous revision we have revised on specific heat capacity and this is the equation. Uh, now we're going on to discuss about heat capacity. Now heat capacity is different, slightly different from specific heat capacity. Now heat capacity usually denoted by the big letter C. Now an example of heat capacity example of a spoon say if it's 900 joules per degree Celsius. Now take note that it's joule per degree Celsius. Unlike for specific heat capacity is joule per kilogram per degree Celsius. Now what does this mean? It means that if I have a spoon currently at 60 degrees Celsius if I want to heat a spoon up to 67 degrees Celsius. Now, this heat capacity of the spoon is given in this example as 900. Now, how much energy is needed? The equation will be energy equals to big C change in temperature. So, in this case, it's 900 times 7 the answer will be in joules so the formula when we use heat capacity is energy equal to C times change in temperature now heat capacity is referring to the object in this case the spoon specific heat capacity is referring to the material example copper so we need to say how much of copper how many kilogram so for heat capacity we are talking about the whole spoon the object so there's no need to say per kilogram so you just say in simple words for every one degree celsius increase in temperature for the spoon i need 900 joules of energy so let's look at the difference I hope you have understood.